Hello to everyone guys and welcome to another Adventure Story Channel video. Today I have a nice job. This is inspection of my engine camshaft, okay? And we will say some things, what we look inside, what we check, okay? And here, as you can see now, the first image is from the space front of the camshaft, okay? This is the doors here, this one. In this kind of uh, engine, this doors is visible, okay? You can see inside what is happening, how all lubrication takes place, the quality of oil, the color of oil, and you can see the flow of the oil through the camshaft, okay? It's very nice this, because you can see with the flashlight, how it's going inside, you can see the flow, you can see the stream of the oil and the quality also. And there's a lot of doors. The one of the door here, it's uh, under the fuel pump, okay? And the other door, it's for the exhaust valve uh, side, okay? Exhaust valve uh, actuator, okay? hydraulic actuator to open the exhaust valve these two doors is for one cylinder okay these two is for the second cylinder and so on okay let's open these doors okay this is the other side here and already it's removed all the cover is removed from here this is what you see at the bottom okay there is some holes the oil is drained okay and going to make its circulation through the system okay that is it here you can check with your hands uh, if there is any metal parts or some dirty to identify what's going on also there is some bolts here you can check the tighten of the bolts if they are loose or not if something is breaking but I have never seen like that to be okay by hand only you can check if it's moving or not sometimes I have found some bolt broken but not in my engine in uh, crane I don't know what the reason they broke maybe over tight from the yard something like that but I have found and also I have experience one chief engineer told me uh, one of the main starting valve this of the studs okay which is there was broken and they determine only when they lose air okay and here we can see the cam this is the cam the surface of the cam this is what you look okay and this one is the surface the surface must be smooth like mirror to not have any other particles as you can see it shines and reflects all the environment around this is here this is uh, the fuel uh, fuel pump knob okay which the cam heats and also here it's the reversing mechanism okay located inside okay if we like to go astern this mechanism change position and changing obtained in firing order okay here it's the cam shaft the main shaft here here is the cam again and here as you can see most of the engine bolts and nuts it's secured by this wire okay there is special apply of this wire if one uh, nut it will be released the other will be tight okay and so on the other one also so it keeps in one position and here here it's the air distributing device in this side this is number one cylinder camshaft view this one here it's the 
which one is this? Uh, this is for the performance, okay? When we put this uh, wire for the performance, this heats one gauge up and down. Okay, and let's see, this is the cam from another side. Okay, this camshaft guys lays on bearings. There is also bearings. Okay, this is another view. This is not so dirty engine. It's clean. But I have seen more clean than this. Most of the bolts here it's hydraulic tight. As you can see, there is here also a lock nuts. For more reference and detail in the description, you can go to the manual, BMW manual, to see exactly how it looks like from details. Okay, the bearings. This is a visual inspection also to see inside what is going around. You can check also the bearings, but that was not the purpose of our job there. There is only visual inspection to see how is the condition of the camshaft, okay? For the bearings, there is special PMS system which make maintenance on this, but this kind of maintenance is very, very big and need to be made by yard and shipyard or in uh, inspections something like that of the engine maybe five year inspection or dry dock and I have experience in my working time we have one damage in the cam here in this side one part was missing uh, this kind of damage was occurred with uh, some damage internally in the camshaft when it was made by uh, the factory. Okay, and after a long time of working, this part goes off. Maybe some bubbles remained inside in the metal, because as you know, this is a solid piece. Okay, which is made by the factory. Some alloy, some adds. Of chemicals they use and what we do we just take a Dremel you know this Dremel machine which have a lot of RPM it's like grinding machine small one with uh, small connections and we grind the surface until it became smooth again this is the only uh, thing we can do in emergency okay if you don't have a cam or if your cam it's not completely destroyed if it's the damage very little you can fix it okay and it depends also in what point is this damage and how you can understand that this damage is by uh, the metal itself okay and if the metal is tired it's different type of the grains of the metal when the metal is cut you can see if it's cut like a, a soft cut and the metal it's everywhere equal that means this is a, a damage from from the heat itself okay if you see the grains is a very rough that means this is from manufacturer and you can find this information, I believe, in the internet. Uh, there is showing what is the cause of the damage of the metal, okay? So, to better understand. From fatigue, from bad design, okay? Let's move on to see next here. Okay, if the, some scratches is very deep, you need also be checked that one. This metal 
it's very solid, very strong, very bright, but uh, the longevity it's very very low. Okay, you cannot expand this metal a lot. Okay, also these metals are not affected a lot from the temperature. Okay, the size must be remained small. This is very precision device part of engine okay and here as you can see how the cam is designed okay this is regulates also the injection time when the injection will be sent to the pump to the through the pump to the fuel nozzles okay more pictures here check if you have some rust inside okay check everything check for check for marks visual inspection is very very important also Okay, as you have seen, we make all the photos through the camshaft and these photos, I believe they see also from the office, if they have small quantity of ships. Okay guys, that is it. Very quickly, we have seen the camshaft here, how it's inside, how it looks like. The only you need to stop the lubricating pump, main lubricating pump, okay? And after you can remove these doors without make dirty yourself. But anyway, you'll get dirty <laughs> from the doors, okay? <clears throat> Guys, thank you for watching. Stay tuned to Adventure Story. More videos coming every week. Thank you, you all that you watch my videos and check these videos also, the previous videos, they are very informative and helpful. Thank you for watching, bye bye.